Hi, I'm Andy Badley. I ran the 1500 meters in the Beijing and the London Olympic Games. Um, I'm here to talk to you about Haymax today. Oh, I love the summer, being able to go out in shorts and t-shirt and, and just be straight out from the door um, and be warm from the start. It's so nice, but for me, I do suffer with um, hay fever at certain times during the summer and that can just make things a little bit more difficult for me. So it's just, it's nice to have found something that helps with that and that makes my life a little bit easier while I'm trying to train so hard in the summer and obviously the summer's the most important time for me. And so I take it with me to training and I haven't had any problems. Um, and then a, a story unrelated to training was that I cut the grass the other day. And it was flying everywhere around me and I was using Haymax and I wasn't sneezing, didn't have itchy eyes, uh, which amazed me really. I thought that there'd be a, a limit to how well it would work, but um, even being a little bit cynical, I was really, really pleasantly surprised. It was, it worked fantastically well for me. So. When I'm training, I can take antihistamines uh, and I'm relatively happy to do that. But even though they're the best ones say they're non drowsy, that's still a risk um, in terms of, you know, that 1% of the top level of my performance. If there is an element of drowsiness from a, something that's stopping my hay fever, then that's something I've never been willing to risk on a competition day. And then from personal experience, I've raced uh, one particular race in Italy where um, after the race, I really suffered for sort of two or three days afterwards, just had hay fever solidly. My nose was streaming, my eyes were itchy, and um, it must have just been dust or pollen or grass or flowers or something that's unique to that, that place. It was a little tiny uh, village called Rieti in Italy that has one of the best races in the world and it's renowned for world records and things. Um, so obviously it doesn't affect everybody the same way it affects me, but um, that certainly hit me hard out there. So now having something that's completely drug free, um, and that I trust and am confident in because I've tried it out uh, and I know that it works um, is great because hopefully that means I can account for that you know one or two percent which is the difference between first and fourth or whatever it happens to be on the day. Um, I tend to just put it on just before I go out for my training sessions because um, that's what I'm most bothered about not sort of having itchy eyes and sneezing and wheezing and all the rest of it. Um, so I'll put it on first thing in the morning before I leave my training session and then again when, uh, if I go out for a second run in the evening I'll use it again then. Um, so normally probably once or twice a day and then extra during the day if I feel like I'm going to pop out in the garden or um, you hear the pollen count on the news is high so to take those precautions. Try Haymax. <laughs> yeah, that's my advice. Anyone that suffers in the summer should try it. Um, you've definitely got nothing to lose, and I think you've got quite a lot to gain because it's really helped me. Um, it's a great product, and it's something I'm happy to say that I use and that um, I use daily. Mm -hmm.